Hello everyone, this is Giovanni from Xiamen Sano Cham Cooperated. Welcome to our live room. Hello everyone, this is Ivy Chen. Welcome to our live room. Thank you for you taking your time to watch our live show this afternoon. And I will be honored to be here to introduce our company first. Xiamen Sano Cham is a professional manufacturer of frozen vegetable, fruits, and mushrooms. We have 10 more years' experience in this field. We have exported to Japan, Korea, Thailand, Vietnam, etc. in the Southeast Asian country, and also exported to Canada, USA, this kind of the America uh, of uh, American country, and also we have exported to European countries, Australia and Middle East, etc. for more than 40 countries and regions. In the meantime, we also have our own factory in Fujian, Zhangzhou City. It's called uh, Chen, uh, Zhang, Chen Tai Fu Cooperated, and we are welcome to be. We are welcome you to come to our boss company and factory to have a check. And our slogan is to make agricultural products never hard to sell. And when in our company, first I want to tell you our company has been certified by BRC Grade A, ISO and HACCP. These three most common kinds of the uh, certification are the words that make sure we can export frozen products to countries and this is the most common ones. And right now, I'm here will tell you some most competitive products in our company. Yeah, Xiamen Shanojiang is specialized in frozen vegetables, frozen fruit, and frozen mushrooms and berries. So. Uh, from this table, as you can see, this is the, the most uh, advantage of our company's product, like vegetables of edamame, broccoli, cauliflower, and green beans, also cauliflower, and the frozen berries like strawberry, raw strawberry, and the mixed strawberries, and the frozen fruit like the frozen plum, frozen metallic orange and uh, frozen aloe peach also like apricot and lychee yeah as if you need some of our product you could contact our customer service for more details we are always here to serve you yes and under the page you could see there's a link for the frozen corn kernels you can just click it and get into our uh, sales person they will be here to solve all the problems right now and you could already see from the page that mm -hmm. the today's main character is the frozen corn uh, kernels and also the mixed vegetable. Both of you have the fro uh, frozen corn kernel, of course. And first, I want to tell you that for frozen corn, for fo frozen sweet corn, we have exported nearly two thousand tons each year. It's solid. It's not just like other vegetable. It's solid, not just the soft one. And also. It's like raisin and sweet but not sour and also sweet but not sour and sweet and solid and for, and as you may already know that frozen corn kernels is suitable for all the ages. Its more edible effect is to uh, delay aging because so it's very good for you know all, all people if you want to slow down the aging process and it's unsaturated fatty acid. And, and the dynamic acid is even up to more than 60% to prevent the and you know prevent you to consume too much fat from the vegetable. And statistically show like frozen corn kernels can reduce the disease like a coronary disease and also the hypertension, hyperlysolistic and media. And it could also prevent the blood cholesterol and the pre, pre and also you know just prevent you from the deposition in your blood vessels so it's very good for your bodies and if you wanted to buy a uh, buy five frozen corners in the market it, from the grocery it's very hard because the from grocery you usually get a whole and intact uh, corn core if you want to cut the color kernels with your knife it's very easy to cut off, but also the appearance will be not as good as you see here. And if you want to do with your hands, that way you could make sure the appearance is okay, but it's a time consuming job. It's going to take out tons of time, and also it's going to hurt your finger. It's not as easy as you think. But we are already finished 
a frozen corn kernel. You could just buy it from the super buy it from the supermarket and find it in a refer and keep it in the refrigerator as long as you want. So it's saving you both time and energy. Why not choose it? And uh, corn flowers of the path is the side the volume is very big. So it is very suitable for the five people to consume it because it's going to you know prevent you from the hungry feelings. It's going to for, 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 it's going to be very full in your stomach. You're not going to feel the hungry. And also, it's very you know, helpful for the fitness crowd because a guys who go to the gyms a lot is going to hurt very much. But the, you know, as I already mentioned, the unsaturated acid in the frozen concern is going to help you to recover. So you're going to go back to gym and work out again very soon. By digest the frozen corn kernel and also if you are very fat and want to get on a diet this is a very good choice for you and now Abby will tell you how we get this raw material from our self-based form yeah from the George uh, introduction frozen sweet corn is a good product and with economic price this is a very common product in yes. our daily life so you could try it. And uh, right now I will give you some information about our farm basis. Because all raw materials of our frozen uh, sweet corn uh, are from our own farm base. Like this one as you can see. Uh, we have uh, about uh, 50,000 acres to plant our frozen sweet corn. And from the cultivation and from the selection of the seed and also the management. Every step is in our control. So as you can see, it, the, the site selection is very also important. We select a location that is most suitable for growing our sweet corn. Uh, as you can see, there is no very tall buildings. Yeah. This is to guarantee that the sweet corn is growing with the maximum sunlight yes. and also this uh, site is to uh, environment is very suitable to grow the sweet corn this is to uh, minimize the insect damages so if you buy the sweet corn from Xiamen Shanoqiang we can guarantee that the product is very good in quality and you can get a very uh, fresh farm product from us. So if you want our product, welcome to contact our customer services and we are always here to uh, at your proposal. Yes, just click the link below the page and you will be get to us. And right now, since you have already known something about our self-based farm, I would like to tell you some strengths of our products. First, our frozen sweet cones is being very well controlled in every step, so the quality is guaranteed. And the sweet cone is the as its name just clarified to us, it's sweet. And also, and the color is bright yellow, and the maturity the maturity rate is about seventy to eighty percent, which makes sure it's. Uh, mature enough for you just digest it's and tender no, enough. Yes, it's tender enough. And we have just mentioned before the location cause the minimi cause the minimization of the worm and worm and also insect damage. And the granule is where is not dry and very clearly is by each one. Our hence this is causing our causing our products have been sold to various countries each year. And with every batch of every new season and every new batch of our of our uh, sweet corn, we will get it to our third-party laboratory to test the microbiology and also the pesticide residues. Here is some of the uh, test result from our third-party laboratory. Yeah, each crop we will uh, test uh, in a third-party testing lab. To yes. get a full report of micro uh, pesticide and heavy vintage. Yes. Yeah. It, each crop we have this kind of this full set of uh, testing report, and uh, during the production and uh, the packing, we also have a full set of record yes. with the size, color, and uh, 
the packing and the, the defects, every step is in full record like this. So you could uh, be uh, guaranteed about our quality and uh, a safe and healthy product. Yes, if you found a little mistake in our products, we can chase the mistake in from our records and we could tell you which part was being wronged during the processing. So you don't have to worry about quality. And besides the third party laboratory test, we also have our own in house laboratories which to test the microbiology and also the pesticide residues again. So bubble check means more safety concern so you don't have and uh, so you don't have to worry about quality every time. And we could provide you not just the single uh, frozen three cones, we can also provide in a mixed vegetable. Mix one is the four mix three mix mixed vegetable waste like the first it contains the frozen green beans mm -hmm. Uh, that's carrot and also our main character, the frozen three cone, kernels. This is three kinds. You you can also mix it in two ways, like only with the that's car carrot, and you can mix it with the four ways. That's uh, carrot, frozen green beans, frozen that's carrot, and also the frozen green peas. These four mix which the ball together. As long as you send juice pieces specification to us we will do it as you request and our harvest season is from July to September so during these two months you can always get a very fresh raw material and it's right now is the July so if you want to get a very good uh, quality of the frozen sweet corn or frozen is vegetable just send your inquiry to us and we have the waxy corn cob and also the sweet corn cob these two kinds. For sweet corn cob, we have the whole ones or the cutting one. If you want it, for example, like three to five meter uh, sweet corn cob uh, segments. And if you want the waxy corn cob, we have the uh, multiple color ones, the golden one and also the white one. Here, I will tell you some more about the detailed information. Yeah, because today when we prepare samples. There we just put two one. This is the mixed vegetable with sweet corn kernels, and this one is the sweet corn kernels. But for frozen sweet corn, we could provide and the kernels like this one, and also the uh, whole cob. Yes. Like the things is about uh, sixteen to uh, nineteen uh, centimeters, and the cut corn on the cob like five to. Uh, three to five centimeters yes. or six to eight centimeters and uh, a part of uh, uh, sweet corn we also could uh, offer you uh, waxy corn, 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 corn. Yeah. Yes. waxy corn cob so you can find more information on this on this one on like, these pictures yes yeah this three one is called uh, sweet corn and like corn kernels cut corn on the cob and yes. this is the Whole corn on the cob, and these two is the waxy corn. This is the colorful uh, waxy corn, and this is the white uh, waxy corn. And also we have black waxy corn and uh, golden yellow yes. uh, waxy corn. And the, these three product is made out uh, as an ingredient with the sweet corn. Like this is a four. Four ways, yes. yeah. Four way mix. Uh, like this is a, the most important and popular in the world. Like green beans cut, green peas carrot, and uh, corn kernels. And uh, this one is three way, three way mix. Like uh, carrot, green peas, and uh, corn kernels. And uh, we could also mix with two one like. Just the sweet corn and green peas. Yes. Yeah. So as long as you give up for these mixed vegetables, you just only need to give us the ingredient and then the uh, percentage of each ingredient, and then we can mix here for you like like this. So you don't need to uh, mix when you want to cook. Yeah, yes. we mix it well for you yes. in our production. So it will save you both time and energy too. And 
for the for, for the, in order to make sure the freshness of the frozen three cones, we will get it to start. We will get it get our factory start to work, start to process after within the twelve hours since the harvest. So the freshness and the nutrition of the of the cone can be kept as much as possible. Yes. And those and during busy work, you know, frozen products always bring us convenience. And if you like, I always heard people will say they want to go to the grocery and supermarket to buy some fresh vegetables to keep and to eat in the um, uh, following several days. But let me tell you one thing: because fresh vegetable is easy to deteriorate because the bacteria, bacteria and the fungus is on the vegetable. It's not going to be removed as the frozen ones. So if you keep it in your refrigerator, mm -hmm. the bacteria and fungus will keep reproduce itself. And after two to three days, it's begin to you know not be able, not be not being able to be edible again. So if you buy it and keep it in your refrigerator, three days tops is gonna to be you know bad enough. It's gonna to be very bad and not suitable and easy for your body to digest. But with our frozen products, all you need all you need is just put into the freezer the freezer of the refrigerator because you could keep because it need to be kept into frozen state. And you could keep it for like three six months and during these six months as long as you want to eat this kind of vegetable, you could just take it out of your refrigerator and warm it up or just cook it the way you like and then you can enjoy a very very enjoying meat. Yeah, very convenient yes. using our frozen uh, product. Yes, and right now we are going to tell you something about the package and... Yeah, uh, the normal packing of our product normally is the bulk, 10 kilo per carton box, but if we are selling to the supermarket or to some uh, uh, the stores, Maybe you need some retail packs like this one. Yeah, so this one is 400 grams, but we could also do like 500 grams, 1 kilo, or 2.5 kilograms per bag. So, as long as you give us your design, we could produce the bag and pack it for you for your requirements. And if your customer is in a factory and want to a bulk packing like tote bin, we could also do it for you. And uh, during the loading, if you want with a patty, it's also okay for us to provide this kind of service to you. So regarding the packing, we could uh, invert that we could uh, pack a maid per your requirements. Yes. So if you are, if you want to retail, or if you want to wholesale, and if you want to process again in your factory, just send your specification or your demands to our sales team. They will be here to solve this problem for you. And if you have you, even you want to design your own bag, we have our tech team to help you to design these bags. So we can provide you so so good service. Just get your inquiry to us, and let's start to work. And since you already know this much, so much about our frozen uh, cone kernel and cone sweet, sweet cone, you must be very curious about how the frozen products, frozen sweet cone, were being made in our factory. Here we will go through the flow chart. And the first step is always the raw material reception, known as the CCP1. And then we will need to peel the frozen cone because you know the husk of the frozen cone you always need to keep to remove it first. And then the threshing to make to let the kernels drop one by one. And then the washing and then the, the most the second the most important part known as the branching also is the CCP2. And then Cooling by the tap water. This is the first time to get it to get the temperature of the products to to you know to to make sure the temperature is not like cold enough and then going to the cold water again because it is about to gain to the IQF machine to uh, you know make the products into a frozen state and then going to the IQF machine and then the semi packing because and then after that we will after the semi packing, you will go into the cold store, cold warehouse again first uh, for the 
and store for storage because you know we can't just selection all the products at one time. And then after that, we will take it out for the second time selections to make sure the insect damage or the defect of our products will be obvious. You know, be pick up and pick out, and then the waning, the waning, and then going to and then sealing, and then going to the mental detection to make sure no foreign matter or some. You know, some bad things may come into some bad color, bad color dis, uh, display or something, and then the packing into our cool, uh, cold storage, and then finally loading and then sending send the products to you. Yeah. So from the whole process, as you can see, it goes a long way from the first step to the final product to you. It's very complex. But the most important of this process I want to special mention is this one. CCP1 is called the raw materials. Now, if you have a good raw materials, and then usually you will get an excellent final product. Yes. So raw materials is important. As I said before, all our frozen sweet corn is from our own farm basis. So we could guarantee the first step the quality. The, our raw material is the best. And then this one is called the branching and this is called the CCP2. It's very important like the time of the branching and the, the degree of the water. This is very important. Yes. And the, the, fun, the third one is this mental detection. For this process is to uh, Make sure that our product is not following materials like the bento pieces, glass pieces as well. So this is three one is the most important. So in our uh passport control. Yeah. Yes. So you could see it's very complicated if you wanted to produce or manufacture the products like this. And if you wanted to know more about the flow chart in our factory, you could even come by yourself, come to our factory. We will show you how every step and we will lead you through the whole factory again and again if you wanted to know more detailed information. And you could always click the link below the page and get to our salesperson. They could send you our flow chart to you. Or if you want to know more and if you have any questions, you can ask them. Uh, about the price, the quality, your specification, the packing you want, just send it to them and then we'll be here to answer all questions. Yeah, yes, right. So yes. right now it is the crop season of frozen of sweet corn. So it's very it's a very good time for you to consider to order. Even order one container to try or even order an annual order. It's a good time for yes. you. Yeah. Yes, try order and you will, find you will maybe this is a big business for you. And after all of this, I would like to tell you the digesting way or the eating ways of our frozen component. The first one is very easy because this one is the most convenient one. You could save your time and you can, you can just eat the foods directly. Just like you need to take it out from your refrigerator, like maybe 500 grams or 200 grams and the carbon will be enough inside the products and then you take it to the boil water to heat it up or blanch for like two minutes or three minutes if you wanted to eat a rather soft one and then you take it out just eat it directly or even uh, after defrost put into micro shop yes. for uh, three to five minutes it's also eat directly so very convenient yes and for as i already mentioned before the guy who the guy like me like I always go to the gym and work basically every day and my muscle will hurt very 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 much and after I eat some cones because there is most of the icy that is causing the muscle pain and this one of the cone and some and this mineral and nutrition inside the cone will solve this acid in a very very good ways and then you will, it will recover you will help you to recover in a very soon time. And the next way I would like to tell you is more like a Chinese cuisine. It's most like a culinary delight. And first way, first you need to prepare the raw material, the frozen coconut of course, and then the sausage, and then cucumber, and salt, sugar, and uh, maybe a two a, a tooth of the oil, and then you can start work. First you need to color cucumber, and then the sausage, and 
this is already finished into dice and these three kinds of material has already been solved and the first one because the cucumber and the sausage are the raw one because they are put just you know you just prepare it so you're going to fry it first put some oil into your pot or your pancake or your pan or, 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 in, or in whatever kinds of the cooking machine you are using and then warm it up for several for one or two minutes and then get in get a cucumber and cucumber dice and then the sausage dice together and then first warm it up and then after that uh, adding the corn kernels, frozen corn kernels and then just uh, in the meantime pull a, pull a pinch of salt, sugar and then any flavoring you, you may like and then keep, uh, keep the fire at the most uh, biggest work uh, efficient and then just cook it for like two or three minutes and then a very good salt, and then a very good meal will be ready for you and then just put it into the pan, put it into whatever the pan you will have and then you can enjoy it yeah so sweet corn is you can eat in many ways and uh, the most uh, common one is just like this and uh, you put into microsoft or just uh, to the pot or e even eat after the defrost eat directly is also okay yeah. yes and if you were if you wanted to eat more you know yeah. to digest multiple nutritions or different kind of flavor this will be a much better choice for you like you know have the green pea that's carrots and then also the sweet corn 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 or this kind it's all have the sweet flavor and it's going to be very great great for your tongues and your stomach yeah the most important is that our variety of sweet corn is called super sweet 903 yes. and but we also have other varieties like jinfei or golden fee like this but right now the popular one is this one super sweet yeah the blue is more than ten. Uh, ten. yes yeah so it's, so it's very good for you it's very good for your tongues and your feel and your feelings when you're trying to cook for yourself yeah and um, and right now as i said right now it's the crop season of this product but yeah, right now it's the still the summer season in China and a lot of products are coming out like uh, the blackberry, the raspberry and uh, the grape and also some vegetables like okra, like green beans all these we are right now in mixed production so if you need more product welcome to contact our customer service for more information and today, the introduction of this sweet corn is going to the end. And uh, uh, thank you for, for your time. time. See you next, next week. Yeah, see you next week. Yes. See you.